Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and happy weekend to you wherever you are watching this video. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for the effort you have made to be here. I sincerely appreciate it. Yes, there is an issue about the Super Eagles. As their coach has left, you know, who is going to be the new Super Eagles coach? That is the question on the lips of all Nigerians. Who is the worthy candidate to take over as the Super Eagles coach? But before we go into that, let me welcome you formally. Thank you so much. If you are here for the first time, it's a channel to be. Please and please subscribe to the channel, press the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time I post the videos and help share the video if it is possible for you to do. Likewise, friends, I want to say to all my amazing subscribers, the new and the returning one, I want to say thank you very much for the support and the love to all my friends out there. Please consider subscribing to the channel. Press the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time I release a new video. Share it as much as you can, guys. Okay? Who is likely to be the next Super Eagles coach after the exit of Joseph Pesero? You know, on Thursday, the 1st of March, Joseph Pesero, the Portuguese tradition, at the helm of the Nigerian men's national team, announced his departure. After a tenure of uh, about 22 months as the Super Eagles head coach, Pesero Stewardship saw the Super Eagles soar to the final of the 2023 African Cup of Nations. We had the narrowly succumbed to host nation Cordova in a gripping showdown. In the wake of uh, Pesero Sensi, the Nigerian Football Federation quickly and appointed uh, Austin Egwefon, a former international and the head of the Nigerian Football Federation Technical Department as interim head coach. However, Austin Egwefon is not inclined to assume the permanent head coach role. We by first half World Cup qualifying features against South Africa. Coming up, the Nigerian Football Federation is on the quest to fill the vacant coaching position expediently. The burning question remains who possesses the, the requisite coaching acumen to lead the Super Eagles to new height. Among the esteemed coaches currently unattached at the triumvirate of Jose Pesero, I mean Jose Mourinho, Mourinho of, uh, of Portugal, Antonio Conte, and Sidney Sidney. However, it's unlikely that Nigeria is able to get this one because financial constraints. And the remote prospect of enticing these illustrious figures to the to African football landscape render their recruitment improbable. However, stepping into the limelight are the following potential candidates. One of them is Emmanuel Amunike, a referred figure in Nigerian football folklore. Amunike illustrious play career reached his pinnacle with triumphs in the in the 1994 African Cup of Nations and the 1996 Olympic Football Cup Tournament. Transitioning seamlessly into the co into coaching, he masterminded Nigerians uh, on the 17 national team to World Cup glory in 2015. The former Barcelona Winger also coached the Tanzania national team, helping them to qualify for the 2019 African Cup of Nations. 
harmonic statistical and tactical argument coupled with penchant for attacking football and dear him to the Nigerian faithful, making him a prime contender for the Super Eagles coaching role. Then we have Sandy Ulisse, a Makuria midfielder. During his playing days, Ulisse boasts proud experience at the helm of the Super Eagles, renowned for nurturing the talent of Wilfred Indidi and Alex Iwobi. His coaching tenor was marked by a tumultuous fallout with the Nigerian Football Federation. However, with a change in NFF leadership, Olisti returned to era the new era characterized by the integration of Bogjun talent and the competitive ethos. And of course, there is Indubusi Egbo, a trailblazer in his own right. Indubusi Egbo is the current manager of Kosovo Super League Club in Prishta. Egbo, himself a former Super Eagles goalkeeper, boasts a rich playing career that traversed Nigeria, Egypt, South Africa, and Albania, where he clean three trophies in Tirana. His coaching journey commenced in 2010, community in his appointment as Tirana head coach in 2019. The pinnacle of Egbo's managerial exploit occurred during the 2019-20 season when he etched his name in history by becoming the first Nigerian coach to lead a European team in league title with Tirana. Egbo's foray into fo European football coupled with a wealth of experience as a player positioned him as a unique and exciting prospect for the Super Eagles coaching role. Then we have uh, Lauren Blanc. Blanc is a distinguished figure in the annals of French football, having won the FIFA World Cup and European Championship with his country. The former defender, with an impressive 97 caps and 16 internationals, goes transition from decorated playing career to a managerial journey with remarkable success. He helped Bordeaux secure League One title in 2008-2009 before assuming the reins of the France national team in the aftermath of the 2010 FIFA World Cup. Blanc-Stair scored to the quarter-final of UEFA 2012. He also won domestic honors with PSG. The 58-year-old was one of the coaches who applied for the Super Eagles job before Pessero was hired in 2022. So, guys, who do you think should be the next Super Eagles coach? Let me know. Till I come your way next time with another video. Bye. Bye.